mind there's going to be a chance. Now there is a cold front that's going to roll through. This is going to cool us off for one day tomorrow and then heat comes right back. But there's that cold front. Look at that. Uh, this uh, latest model popping up a thunderstorm just south of Grand Island about midnight, one o'clock in the morning and it quickly moves off to the south and east and dissipates. So we'll see. I, I'm not, uh, I wouldn't bet on it, uh, but again, there's a small chance we could see an isolated thunderstorm in south central Nebraska. Then high pressure moves in and removes all threat for precipitation for a while. This is 1 p.m. Thursday, high pressure moves in. Nice day on Thursday. There's gonna be a northwesterly flow, so uh, we're on the cooler side of things. Low dew points, lower temperatures, but here comes the heat and the humidity along with this warm front. This is Thursday night, not quite here yet, but it's going to get here. Friday, especially Saturday, Sunday into Monday. That hot air is going to be making its presence known for a while. Tonight though, tolerable, uh, middle 60s. Uh, we'll do uh, 65 in Lincoln, a few clouds here and there, near normal, that's about where we're supposed to be this time of year. Southeast wind dying down to around five to 15. Thursday, lower 80s, maybe some middle 80s. Again, the dew points should be lower. Friday, we start to warm back up. I think a similar day, maybe a little more humidity, but temperatures in the lower 90s, and then triple digits just about everywhere on Saturday, uh, 100, 103, maybe even a little bit higher in some spots, and we may be talking about heat advisories before it's all said and done. So uh, 82, 92, 100, and then we stick with the triple digits Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, and it doesn't cool off a whole lot. It does cool off some, but uh, back into the lower 90s by the end of next week. But that is a stretch of some hot weather, uh, and that happens. You know, it's August, it's still summer uh, technically, so uh, 100s are not out of the question. It's just unfortunate to see all of that heat and no precipitation chances over the next 10 days, which uh, we still need. We're still in that mm -hmm. drought, so uh, uh, we'll see if we can get things changed up. But for now, hot, humid, and dry for a while. At least we had that break in there, right? Mm -hmm. Where temperatures weren't too bad, but now back to the triples. Yeah, for a while. well, tomorrow's one more day. Get out and enjoy tomorrow because it gets hot after that. All right, thank you, Rusty. It was a negative day on Wall Street today. The Dow